Hi, betting experts. On Tuesday, October the 3rd, we're staying up in Scotland, this time to air on Tuesday. The ground on the softer side of good at the time of recording. A competitive card with excellent prize money for midweek. We start off with our betting expert daily nap, sponsored by Bet365. This runs in the 322, a class four, a handicap over one mile, two, three-year-olds and upwards, over five grand to the winner. And I think Tilsit can snap a losing run stretching back to here in July 2022. Now, he's a six-year-old now. He comes from the Michael Smith yard, going okay at the minute. Had a winner in the last 14 days. Hardly unexposed till sit. 43 career starts, but a good return. Six wins, nine times in the frame. He's been a good money spinner for connections. He goes well with cutting the ground. His last win came with a mark of 79 over this course and distance last July. He's now five pounds lower, having been in the mid-80s at one point, and I think he should be spot on now. He's had a couple of months off uh, in midsummer and returned with a creditable fourth at Musselburgh. And I thought last time out, he probably just didn't stay in the end. But he's shaped quite well over a trip he's never tried before, one mile five. That's meant he's come down another two pounds. And I think he actually ran well, to be honest with you. He's got optimum conditions here, a bit of cut in the ground. It should be a truly run race, which will help him. And I think he can swoop late under Frankie McDonald. Our betting expert value angle selection, sponsored by Bet3. 365 goes in the 357. It's a handicap, a class three for three year olds and upwards, over seven furlongs and 50 yards. Over nine and a half thousand pounds to the winner, and I think the top weight here, Master Zoffany, can win again. Now he's been a pretty tough, durable, and reliable performer for Richard Fahey. Twenty-one career starts, five wins, two places. Returned from six months off in need of the run, but ran well on soft ground at Chester up to a point in August, and again back at Chester last time out. I thought he did well to win under Billy Garrity, having to be switched out wide and sustaining a strong run to power clear late. I think that seven and a half furlongs with a bit of cut in the ground was fine he's back half a furlong in trip here but long air straight a wide galloping track I think that'll suit him a mark of 89 should still be well within his compass with conditions to suit Oishinor's booked who knows him well and I think Masters often he represents a class above these rivals most of whom struggle to win at the best of times best of luck on Tuesday betting experts and please remember to like and comment on all of our YouTube videos Thank you.